Alright guys, so we are finally now outside of the, the villa to do the next part of the video. Well, first of all, welcome back to Stuck on an Island where I'm stuck with you guys and we are always smiling. Bright sunny day, very bright sunny day. We are going to do a bit of um, cliff jumping or whatever, we're going to start small. And yeah, really nice day in Jamaica, really nice weather. Ready? Let's do this. What direction are we going? Okay. Well, yeah, that's the part that you wanted to go. Go. Wait, I want to take some pictures first. Take some pictures? All right, there you go. Alright guys, I'm literally sweating after taking at least 50 photos for Judah. No, he's on the arm, I think. So, yeah. We are going to start small. Maybe from there first. And then get into the water, man. So, you want to jump first? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go check the depth of here first, yeah? I'm going to show you deep enough. Was it? That was good. That was good. For the after effects of the salt. The salt water. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, guys. I was a little bit skeptical, a little bit scared. But once you do it, yeah. <laughs> I think it takes two times. How do you do it? Oh hell yes. Just gotta do it. Yeah, the reason why I check it, make sure it's good. What most persons don't know, when they cliff dive or whatever, you can get um, spinal injuries. Because once you jump high enough and your feet are not the right way, yep, it can mess you up really bad. Or even if you belly flop. If you do a regular belly flop in a pool, it hurts. Imagine higher than that, so. But it was fun though. This, is, this isn't very high. You jump on this, one? You wanna jump on this, though? Oh, cause I saw you like making like a go jump. I 
going back up. All right, so Judah hates salt water, but she gonna snorkel a little bit. Remember what the guy taught you in Mexico? Put the headband to the top of the. So the headband should come somewhere at the top back of the head. Yep. Do whatever you want to do. No, I did the fishes. Uh, are for the old? They are there, anywhere. Almost, yeah, we have everywhere. Let's look. Oh. Do you see them? This water is worried if it was too shallow. Huh? This one you have to double check. Oh, you have to double check. Deep, right? Yeah, it is. It's deep enough. As you guys can see, like the tides are picking up, so it's a lot rougher than this morning. again guys <laughs> look at her look how look how wide look how wide she got herself blow hot Blow hard. Hard? <laughs> Is that your blow? <laughs> oh my god. Look up there. Hard blow. Yeah, all the water is done. With this particular one, if you want to go down the water, it traps water from coming in. Go again.
<laughs> Guys, when I tell you have to do things on need to basis. So anyway, that's what I was to make out casually. Had my GoPro in my pocket, the GoPro fell out into a very deep spot here. And I was just like, alright, I can hold my breath long enough to get down there. But I haven't learned how to equalize so well. Bruh, I was like, I'm not leaving my GoPro. <laughs> that was a <laughs> that was the furthest I ever dove just now, yo. <laughs> of course, I have to go broke, so. working on um, how to equalize once I get deeper so I went very deep just now for that but what I really enjoyed about there is that the fish feel at home I mean they're in the water so they should be at home but I usually when you're swimming or whatever by the time you kick your paddles a couple of times uh, the fish will be gone but they were just there eating living their best life so I'm with some um, baby jacks um, there was doctor fish, there was um, parrot under there as well and you could see that they definitely helped the, um, the ecosystem because they were munching at like the algae or whatever that's below the water so um, that was pretty cool to, to witness and my favorite part was actually seeing um, the little light rays coming through yo, <laughs> let me tell you, this is definitely a very nice little snorkel spot so if you come here and you like snorkeling, you're not going to just see like beer, sea flooring, there's gonna be fish. All right guys, so that was a short little vlog, not, did nothing special, um, you know, some our own or whatever the case is. So, hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, why are you looking at me like that? Yo, when you're closing off your video, I never said, oh, because I'm naked. Yeah, it's one of those things. Anyway guys, um, <laughs> remember these three things, love, nature, adaptation, and always remember, keep the link.